Hey, Mr. Blue back here with part 11 of the Sly Cooper and the Thievius Raccoonus playthrough. Um, no, there's no Aaron S here today. He's he's gonna be maybe appearing later on. Alright, a little dialogue from our next boss there, Ms. Ruby. This part had me aggravated for a little bit, because it's one of those things like the crab level in uh, Raleigh's world. You have to move around with the left analog and fire, um, or, yeah, kind of like that kind of thing. You have to, only this time you have to run over the things instead of just shooting down the crabs. I did this really late, and you're going to see me fail so much. Now I hate that. Why? Why do I only have two minutes to get all the torches lit? There's... and... what? I just don't get it. There's some real life, like it would be like, all out, complete and total. You can do this as long as you want. But new. I will say, I'm not feeling too good right now, so if I do seem a little down or something doing this, it's because my stomach's kind of upset. 64 ounces of Dr. Pepper for breakfast will do that to you. Remember, children, don't drink 64 ounces of Dr. Pepper for breakfast. It's unhealthy. Die. Arr. If there was no timer, this level would be so much fun because you could just run over fish. Just like, die, piranha! That's what you get for biting my foot. Basically, if you have two minutes, so if you get 12 of uh, 25 in, with the one minute, you know you're at least doing halfway good. <laughs> but it's better to have near like 15 or something by the time the minute, the halfway point's reached. I don't really have a strategy for doing this. I basically just try to get as much of them, as much done as I can in the time that I'm given. And if it doesn't work out, then I try again. Yeah, I got 20 seconds to get five, so that's like about four seconds per light. <laughs> and I do have one little piece of advice that might work. I don't really try it, but it might work. Stick with a line, a pattern of the ones you're going after. <laughs> Otherwise, you're just gonna end up all over the place, not knowing which ones you got and which ones you didn't. But I don't know if that works or not. Most likely does because I don't try it and I end up failing. <laughs> Die, fish! Now you gotta think. This is like gotta be the like new technology of the future that you're driving right there. Because it has the power not only to like hover on the on the water and all that, it has the ability to, when you run over a fish, grind it up, drain the oil out of it, and turn it into fuel for a flamethrower. That's flipping sweet. All right, 20 seconds till halfway point, and we only got eight. Isn't that magical? Running time. Ah, uh, missed. Epic miss. I hate this because the fish end up sometimes not being really anywhere, <laughs> and even if you do find one, it's in a only by itself. All right, it's been a halfway point for a while now, and we still got twelve. Yeah. I think we can't do this. Sorry for my being down, I'm a little upset right now. Die, fishy! 
this kind of game is if you feeling upset and all that don't play this game it's not gonna do you any good if you're feeling upset and you need to just take some frustration out on anything play something like God of War that will take your frustration out fast because you can go from like complete and total frown to smiles instantly as soon as you s grab a harpy step on her and rip her wings out it's just beautiful Oh, I will have you all know that I am going to be trying to get all of the Sly Cooper playthrough done by the end of by this weekend. And hopefully I can have it all up by, I'm thinking, Sunday or next week. This level's fun. I'm going to be very picky about which pigs I'm going to fire. Yeah, those corporate pigs. Mm -hmm. Oh, by the way, I'm going to announce that I'm going to sponsor somebody here for a little minute. Unofficial sponsoring. Um, IGN.com for all of you Bioshock fans. I am the biggest Bioshock fan I have ever met. I know it sounds weird, but it's true. I love Bioshock. I love the story and everything. I'm actually thinking of probably doing a playthrough of it, even though there is another playthrough out there by some, another guy who does it on like the expert difficulty, which I found pretty tough. But yeah, I might be doing it. IGN.com has just released a video of, of a little like game insider look on Bioshock 2. And I found this out from Aaron S. He informed me of it because he knows how I am about Bioshock. See, right here is kind of... I get kind of panicky. Because I'm like, oh no, you don't. And... Look, that was, that was horrible. It was lit. It even lit after it said try again. <laughs> <sighs> you can imagine my frustration not only being up at 12 o'clock at night well, right now it's probably near 1 by the time I started doing this but also I'm kind of upset with the fact that I can't get I can't seem to beat this I just just can't you know what I'd do if I were Sly I would like go up there and just shoot like the old door open with fire. That could work. Wait, or is there like a magic thing blocking it? Dang, it's always this excuse for everything. Why can't we? Magic. Or how does that happen? What if this happens in this? Magic. Dang, those wizards. Right here, I'm just like, alright, this is sick and tired. I'm sick and tired of all this crap. Just running around, yeah, die fish. But see, yeah, I got 45 seconds left and six to get. I think that was doing pretty good. <laughs> Frustration might actually be a good help in this. <laughs> it's pretty awesome. Die fish. So yeah, I got pretty much plenty of time. Ten seconds per fish. Now twenty seconds for one. There we go. Hooray! Finally! Victory! Yeah! Alright, well I just wasted this entire part. So I'll see you next time in part twelve of the Sly Cooper playthrough. <laughs>